Hey YouTube, it's your girl Callie Figure 8 and welcome to another Talkative Thursday. So this week I'm going to continue um, from last week's video of I'm not giving up no matter what you think. Um, I got a lot of responses um, privately to that video and it really touched me that people were willing to be so open with me and share their stories. Um, I did get messages from people that I didn't know as well as those that I did know and I was most impressed first of all I was impressed overall with the fact that um, you would take a moment to respond back to me but then I was also most impressed with those that I actually do know um, when you shared your stories because I would have never match those stories up with the person that I see you as being so it was um it was very moving for me it was so moving to the point that on last Friday which was the day after I posted the video I called my medical provider and scheduled an intake um, for therapy and um, being a psychologist minor and a sociology major I've always thought, you know, counseling is wonderful. Everybody needs therapy. It doesn't hurt. And, you know, I've gone before for family counseling and it was very beneficial. But I hadn't seriously considered it for weight loss. Um, I would watch um, Biggest Loser. I'm saying I'm a lot. I'm sorry. I am a Biggest Loser fanatic. And I would watch a lot of, um, a couple of seasons ago, I want to say in 2009 or so, Jillian Michael started tapping in to people's issues. And it would be a person that maybe wasn't losing as much weight or they were self-sabotaging at the ranch or they were at a plateau. And she would tap into why they weren't pushing further than the point that they had gotten and we all know on biggest losers camper they do lose weight but it would be somebody that didn't lose weight biggest loser style or it would just stop or gain or whatever and so she started tapping in so i kept saying and, and i would say over the years i need a jillian michaels moment i need to know what's holding me back and i want to say that that video from last week was me scratching the surface um, when I think of issues people have, you know, my dad wasn't there, you know, you know, or, you know, I didn't have things as a child, you know, those are a lot of things you hear people say. And so it was like, you know, like I shared, we, um, we didn't get a lot of eating out, but I still had my mom and, you know, my dad wasn't there as I was growing up. But I dealt with that issue, and I and I know that that's not why I'm not losing weight. So I kept thinking, well, what could it be? And I don't know. I really don't know. There are some things I have in mind. Um, I'm comfortable being uncomfortable, meaning I know this life, and I know that life will change once I lose weight. And... Am I ready for that change? Because change is good, but change is scary, especially when you've been in routine for a long time. So if I were to assess myself, um, I would say it has to do with me being afraid of who I will be once the weight is off. So I am hoping that through counseling, I can actually nail draw in on what the problem is or if it's that or if it isn't, figure out what the issue is and um, work on overcoming that so that I can push forward and, you know, continue with this weight loss journey and have success. You know, it's not a if, it's a when, but I want the win to be now more than later. So I just wanted to give you guys a quick update. I'm not sure if I will update um, you all throughout my counseling sessions. I may be very vulnerable. I don't know what to expect. But I will um, give you some feedback from time to time because I think it is important 
that we share with one another um, our struggles as well as our successes. So um, for those of you that are prayer warriors, say excuse me, say a prayer for me um, Monday 3 p.m. I do my intake. I am going in with a smile. I'm not going. I'm not upset. I'm not afraid. I'm ready to go full speed ahead. And um, I thank you all for your support. And um, and I look forward to your continued support. Have a great one and God bless.